Okay, as an aside, if Shy Guy got into crypto, I'm 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 I'm, I'm banning him. <laughs> I know I don't have that authority, but I will find a way to have that authority. Yeah, all right. So, um, yeah, the sword might not be quite as long, but I don't know if you know this. There are certain other advantages to Steve, uh, as we're seeing already. Just beating the crap out of Peach with his wooden stick. <laughs> all right, but Peach has combos of her own that she can instantly you know, just answer back with. Now, one of, the one of the funny things is that because we play on uh, Hazards Off, not Omega, I believe stages do actually have uh, different chances to generate different uh, elements. And I think this one specifically, the, sorry, materials are iron is very plentiful on PS2. All right, yeah, cool iron you got there, bro. All right, by the way, did any of you guys watch the, uh, the Why Do video? on um, the new Steve tech. Shout outs to Waidu, uh, the, the best content creator. <laughs> and oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my. Yeah, that's, that's what we in the business like to call a cool 84. 105. It keeps growing. Oh, that was interesting. I think you tried to use the uh, the block to possibly block the booty, but it didn't quite work out. But he's managed to even things up. I mean, this is, yeah, this is a straight up even. Ah, but a nice back air from Cody going to be taking it. And we're seeing that this is kind of one of the weaknesses of uh, Steve, is when he gets put in the corner, you know? <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't necessarily have the greatest options to get out of there. That's what Cody's abusing right now. And ah, yes. Does he have any? Oh, yeah, he does have a lot. Of he has not pulled diamond once this game. Is that because of the stage? Huh. That is very interesting. What a neat factoid. Oh. Uh -huh. Now, how long has Shaggy been playing Steve? Because it's, I feel like there are two breeds of Steve players. There are the Steve players who uh, have kind of jumped on the hype train recently and are like, wow, this character has these kinds of combos? That's dumb and silly. And then you have other Steve mates who are playing for a long, long time. And they're the ones who are like, I do a uh, X minus three positional <laughs> block placement in order to do a weird kooky setup that works maybe 20% of the time. And they just do that 50 times. Bound to work out. Uh, so yeah, definitely saying, hey, there's the diamond. Hilarious. That's actually so funny. He finally got the diamond at the very end of the game and just used it as a baiting tool. It's like, I got diamond. Places down the crafting table. Cody panics. He's just like, I need to stop him from getting the diamond. And then he just steps back, bullet smashes. Yeah, bro. You think I needed the diamond? <sighs> All right, but Shy Guy taking game one with uh, a less crusty uh, Steve than I was expecting to see. All right, here we go. We have, so far, a pretty even game. Answering back and forth. Both characters are doing the nice, nasty combos that they ooh, are known to do. And, oh, my God. Yeah, this is, I feel like, giving us a showcase on the weaknesses of Steve. He still gets trapped in the corner, still gets put off stage. And Peach is able to, she loves it when opponents are trapped in the corner because then her moves become so much better at killing. And... All right, and we're also seeing a little bit of matchup knowledge, knowing that he can throw the turnip at the uh, at the wall in order to just re-grab it and anti-damage. 
Seeing a lot of cool stuff from uh, Cody in the matchup. Oh, there's Saturn. Yeah, grab him again. <laughs> Honk. All right, well, there it goes. It was cool while it lasted, but it's looking like a going to be a pretty clean game for Cody. As I say that, managing to take the first stock. Now Shy Guy is not dead, 150%. Granted, you know, Steve has ways of, even if he's going to die pretty soon, if he gets, like, one solid hit in there, especially with gold, which is uh, I believe has the best frame data of all of the weapon variants, he might be able to get a ton of damage in that will alleviate stem some of this bleeding that he's uh, currently having to go through. All right, about 41%. It's not nothing, but it's still going to be quite a bit of work for him if he wants to uh, bring things back into his favor. All right, iron weapons once again on the table. All right, a nice solid grab. That's an option that... Oh, you fool. <laughs> Your own cheeky block destruction working against you right there. And this is actually, I want to say that's really cool from uh, Peach. The float is really useful. You saw how just was able to fly, float over minecart. A lot of characters can't do that. They have to jump over it in kind of an obnoxiously committal way. And uh, Peach is like, no, I want to be floating at this height anyway. Oh, my God. I mean, minecart will still catch landings like we just saw. Right now, let's see how much damage Cody can do. Is that going to kill? Yes, it is. We now have... Oh, diamonds are online. Do the same thing as before. Um, yeah, he's. I think he's trying to uh, find the opening so that he can actually craft the weapon he wants to. Getting more materials, just building this wall, staying on the platform right there. I think that he really, I, I love that, the way that Cody's almost like camping the uh, the crafting table, not letting him get that diamond weapon online, which is what he wants more than anything else right now. It'll just make the playing field so much more even. He's, oh, I oh, okay, there it is, finally. He got that one, he was looking for a meaningful hit before committing to actually building it. And there you have it. Now with that diamond weapon online, this becomes a lot scarier, a lot scarier for Cody. All right, look at how much damage and knockback that does. And the forward smash does it. The diamond weapon making the difference right there. Oh, and that's going to be the 2-0 victory for Shy Guy.